Good morning, good evening, and good afternoon. My name is Salamander, and today we are back with another advanced PvP guide. And today we shall be talking about the Red Mage, the hardest of the free casting roles to learn, and is unique in the fact that Red Mage can switch up to a melee playstyle. The Red Mage was highly popular after the 6.1 rework, However, since then, they have received several nerfs, and have since faded in both popularity and playtime. That being said, the Red Mage is still a blast to play, and is still capable of those high kills, high damage matches. I would not be surprised to see a buff coming to the Red Mage within the coming months, so if you are looking to learn the elegance of the swashbuckling Red Mage, then stay tuned, as we shall be going through the comparisons, the skill sets, strengths, and weaknesses. Thanks again for clicking on today's video, and let's get into it. Let us begin with a comparison to see if the Red Mage is truly the job for you. First up, we have the Summoner. If you are new to PvP, the Summoner is great for making the learning experience much easier. Capable of holding back and chipping away at a player's health from great range, their powerful slipstream is strong around objectives and choke points. In the moment you need to quickly finish up a target, you drop all casting, and instead rush to your target with the Crimson abilities and the Fester for fast explosive damage. The Summoner's ultimate comes with great ease of use. Simply drop down the Hammett or your Phoenix for either large-scale damage or large-scale healing. And next up we have the Black Mage, the most popular casting role currently in PvP. For those of you looking to devastate with pure explosive damage, then Black Mage just might be the job for you. Their fire rotation can apply burns to a target for extra damage over time. However, their more popular ice rotation can apply three different CC effects, Heavy, Bind and Deep Freeze. If having free crowd control skills was not enough, you also have a fourth, Sleep, that strikes your target and anyone nearby. You are also capable of dashing into team members, enemies and even yourself. This grants the Black Mage Swiftcast to be combined with a powerful burst skill, for high damage and obtaining a very powerful shield for themselves. To top it all off, the Black Mage has one of the fastest charging ultimates, allowing you to run around instantly popping off flares and blizzards into entire groups. So what makes the Red Mage different? Unfortunately, to the current date, the Red Mage has suffered many nerfs, and I feel currently a lot of what the Red Mage can do is done better by the Black Mage. That being said, the Red Mage has several benefits. They come equipped with the White and the Black stances. Each stance grants access to a separate skill. White will grant you bonus shielding during the melee combos, while the Black stance will apply bonus damage over time. Which stance you use will also allow you to use either Bind or Silence. Played well, the Red Mage can easily compete with the Black Mage and the Summoners in terms of kills and damage. They are also better for 1v1 duels, switching from their ranged role to a close quarters melee combat within a blink of an eye. I have found Red Mages can make escapes much easier. Good use of your Guard, your Silence and Displacement to jump back really help escape situations where Summoners and Black Mages would truly struggle and overall with some practice, is a wonderfully fun class to learn. For you beginners looking for a job based on difficulty, I would rank the Summoner 1 star, the Black Mage at 2 stars, with the Red Mage holding the 3 star for more confident players. Your basic rotation will depend on your stance. For the White stance you have the Stone into the Aero 3, however under Black stance you have the Fire into the Thunder 3. Both combos base damage is a combined 10,000, with the second spell being a instant cast. While looking for the opportunity to get in close, this will be your rotation of choice. Next up is Corpse of Corpse and Displacement. These are your mobility skills. Corpse will allow you to dash to your target. For the following 7 seconds, you will deal 10% more damage to that target, while at the same time receive 10% less damage from that target. Aim to use this before the melee rotation for the additional damage and equally handy for targets trying to flee. Close the gap to follow up with your spells while your melee rotation is on cooldown. Your displacement is your evade, allowing you to jump back 15 yards. Combined with a good use of your guard allows you to escape tough situations. The jump back will also make your next damage skill and healing skill 20% more effective. A perfect combo for the flare into large groups of enemies, and even with the holy to grant you and those nearby a health boost. Next we have the magicked barrier, which can only be applied under the effect of White Stance. You and all nearby party members will receive 10% less damage, and receive a 10% healing buff for the next 10 seconds. This makes for a great battle opener, giving your team the slight advantage, 
and will help you outlast the opposing team. While under the effect of Black Stance, this action becomes Frazzle, a highly underrated skill. All enemies within take an additional 10% damage, and their healing skills and actions are reduced by 10%. This can be used in many ways, to kick off the battle, or to even maintain momentum in combat. Timed well with your team's burst skills and even their ultimates will allow you to drop targets faster than they can respond. And next up we have Resolution, 8000 damage to your target and anyone within a straight line. With White Stance, Resolution will apply Silence, and under the Black Stance will apply Bind, which you choose will depend on your situation. Bind is wonderful to prevent escaping targets, and Silence is to set up kills for your team and shuts down hard to kill enemies such as tanks. Pay close attention and you can shut down the most powerful ultimates. A samurai about to Zantesuku in your team can be stopped with a well-timed silence. Next up is your melee rotation. Enchanted Riposte into Zewetsu into Redoublement. For 6,000 damage, 7,000 damage and thirdly 8,000 damage. With your white stance active, during each of these melee combos will apply shielding to yourself. With black stance you will apply additional damage over time. This allows you to play safer while close up or to really burn down targets with extra damage. Your melee combo ends with either the Holy or the Flare. Always use Displacement beforehand for the bonus damage and bonus healing. The Flare will hit the 12,000 to all players around your target, while the Holy will deal 8,000 to all targets, but will additionally grant you and your party healing. Following this rotation up with your ultimate can devastate entire teams. For your ultimate, we have the Southern Cross, and this ult is unique. You can target either an enemy or a party member, and combos very well with Dark Knights. As of patch 6.35, the ultimate's base damage has been increased to 8000, with the cure potency also being 8000. The 100% potency buff while under either black or white shift has now been reduced to 50%. This change to 50% means the bonus damage or healing applied hits for 12000 the same as it was before the patch. To top it off, anyone within the center of the cross will receive the effects twice, equaling up to either 24,000 in healing or 24,000 in damage. This combos so well with Dark Knight, they pull targets in and follow up with their ultimate. Not only does the Dark Knight set up the perfect opportunity for you, at the same time you will heal the Dark Knight, highly increasing their chance to survive. And not just Dark Knights, be looking to combo off with all jobs. With your help you can make that target's chance of survival zero. For your strengths, you have high single target burst damage and strong crowd control. You have the benefit of switching between two powerful utility spells. Few targets can escape, as the Red Mage can both close the gap and switch into their melee playstyle. With the right teams and aggressive play, the Red Mage is able to set up fast kills. Should someone dive you, switch to the White Shift and deal melee damage while you retreat to gain a defensive barrier. As mentioned, you are a Dark Knight's best friend. Your ultimate will set up the perfect play and heal the Dark Knight simultaneously. When tanks are in your face preventing escape, using Guard, Bind and Displacement make for an easy escape. Being a casting role, you are at the mercy of the cast times and within high demanding situations can very easily make you miss your timings. Your damage and CC while powerful fall short to the CC and the power of the Black Mage. With this placement being a jump back skill, it can be all too easy to jump the wrong direction, further into the enemy team. A lot of the Red Mage's actions require good team follow-up. Bad teams will make your job way harder. It can also be very hard to keep good positioning. Being caught out in the open means a very fast death as a Red Mage. And there we have it everything one needs to know for learning the Red Mage in PvP. Once you get past the learning curve, it is single-handedly one of the most fun roles to play, so get out there and give it a go. Thanks again for clicking on today's video, and I shall see you all in the next one. I'll pop Magic Barrier if they rush us. You know, if anyone turns up instead, actually. I was going to say, but what I kind of want to do is push this one, honestly. Yeah, come with. I'm going to silence the summoner. Now. Nope. Yep, that was the easiest extra. kill of my life. Go for the next extra. Step, step, step. He knew we weren't his team, right? I don't think so. I need to go back quickly. I'm just so slow that the need to swap out this inventory. That's him pushing bridge. I'm going in. Frazzle. Silenzo. I'm done. Logging out with this game. There you go. 
beach. Going back. Most and incredible. Cliff. And double cliff. Reds, I don't think I've noticed they're pushing bridge. So we should have this. Right behind you. Hit him with silence. Oh, that's a lot of them. Yeah, it is. I'm still heavy. There we go. On that monk, yeah. Free knockout. Warrior coming in. Silence. Silence is on there. And we've got bonus healing. He's just deleted. <laughs> Never mind. No breaking them. On Beautiful. That, that was insane. On this machine is close. Yep. Silence now. What's this scarlet red one? Flare. Oh, I did not want to go over there. Hello, ninja sir. Just leave me alone, please. I'm out. On their base. And there's the doctor. Hot, 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 hot. On the slink. <laughs> that got heated, but I'm out. Good day, sir. Let me pop a chalk in, I'll join you. Silence down, go in. I've got signs primed. Machinist. Oh, Bonus healing. On that paladin. Actually, I switch an extra. Oh, I'm gonna break that. That's running down the ramp. She's guarded and jumped off. Oh, he was so close to die. Guard down. On paladin up top. I know it's a bit old. And now it's time to get not that he was getting away. Okay, my next science is primed. Ball on the ramp. Hitting him. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's his limit breakdown as well. Gone. I see a bard. I see very far on the left next, I think. Black mage. Frazzledim. Oh. Close. Seven knockouts. It was top right. Hey, I'm right. Let's go. Are you sure you're not part of the Matrix? Possibly. Tom Berry's no future. Tom Berry's our future. And my next limit break is ready. I need one more kill, I got the 100 battle high already. Shit. I'm only on 40 points. Because all the assists I'm getting, I've only got one knockdown. They're thinking about it. Hit him now. Frazzled. I've won fair, so you can't be CC. Beautiful. And right, now some CC with guard. Paladin on point. Hit him with the silence. I think that's theirs. to get murdered because Reds are pushing in on them as well now. <laughs> but we should get ready for our beach. Red the captain's on their base. Just seen that real quick. Chicks frazzled. I'm gonna go for the base one because it looks like the trunk test. I jumped the wrong way. Tom Berry Freedom, I'm out. I'll go up mid. There's a red up here already, that's half health. Olive Brands, yep. <laughs> I've just been double bound. <laughs> Can't get off the mount. There we go. Hit him with silence for you. As soon as I can get in range. A little more. A little more. There we go. <laughs> that was such a struggle. Got meds. Yellow trying to push behind. Stop. Flare in their ramp. Big damage. Easiest kill of my life. The machine has jumped off and killed himself. Nice. So I'm almost at living break, just popping Red chocolate. somehow captured four. The two behind us as well, even though team were there. Should we pick them off? I'm just popping chocolate. There's a one-inch player. Left again. Come on with, come on with. And yellow's got one in base, so yeah, we'll probably get the bottom left one. If we get this early, it's going to be a pretty decent lead. That's why I wasn't too fussed that Red captured four, because Same. there will be ranks. Ooh, a dancer. Silence 
they're thinking about it. They got it. Back off. Get rid of it again. Just a little, just a little taste. <laughs> just a taste! Or potentially beach next again. Got my taste! <laughs> nice. Brazil! Ah, that it. Had to get a fr had to get a frazzle and a, uh, a flare in. Understand, sir. But that's most yellows fraying off. I've got a silence. Silence the warrior. Red just got free capped on anymore as well. Giving us bonus healing. That's for captain. Flare in the ramp. Huge damage. Official leave. Come back up. He's yellow pushing from the left for some reason. Now they're all backing off. Fuck. Get ready for beach next though, I think. Yeah. Just okay. repoke mid for a minute. Sans the warrior. Nice. Yeah, it's gotta be beach next surely, hasn't it? And maybe a cave. Or it's Red's base, and that's gonna piss me off, honestly. <laughs> no, the cave that was an A rank a minute ago. The Red got it for free cap, so it shouldn't be a cave again. If it is, we just full send. Beach, beach hell yeah. And our base. Mm. Beach first, beach first, yeah. because Red's are in the lead. Yellow or not. Uh, the two. I'm gonna hold close. Speaking of, there is a monk that just backed off. Caught me a gunbreaker. Oh, oh. Peace, Candy. Gonna silence him now. I bound him as well, so he literally <laughs> couldn't go nowhere. Okay, we're capping that now. I don't think he could dismount at all. I think, but I'm left also good. Right, well, we've capped that 100% at the beach. So if we go bottom left now, just to confirm it. Couple of are trying to get around. Too late. And then I'll probably be mid again, honestly. Just the way that the game's going. Yellow's in that bottom left, but not enough, but like, there's enough of us to do something about that monk way around. Got him. Player in the machinist. Challenge in the machinist. Bouncing off the machinist. There's more behind, more behind you. I know, I'm dead. Come around, try and help you from above. Signs in the machinist. Oh, they stopped. They're, they're, they're stopped. I'm bonusing it for you. Yeah. Uh, in our spawn. Yeah, but Reds are here already. Yeah. This is a problem. Ooh, I'm going to stay clear of that for a minute. Round, yeah, I've got a long way. <laughs> All I've seen was red. Red. Gunbreakers are extended. Frazzled him. Found him. Ah, uh, red, Reds have kept this one, I think. Not enough people pushing. Big flare up. We can take the points back at least. On the bard. Honestly, I don't see teams Holy losing as many points in this one. <laughs> yeah, that was a lot. But then we literally, that was like three Bahamas at once. Yeah, that went from full to gone. <laughs> I think we found a little stack there. That was well coordinated. Hmm. Right behind you. We are gonna have to push red still, honestly. Yeah. Gonna silence that ninja as soon as I get to him. Three, two, now. As soon as it comes out of him, silence him again. No effect, apparently, because ninjas can do that. Gonna seal him while we back up a little second. That's summoner. Step, step, step. Summoner can still die, maybe. Oh yeah, he's Green Bell, high bard, he's, he's low, can you see him? I see him. Found him. Silencing on him. He's healed anyway. One on that machine is behind. Get him. Nice, switch him to the, uh, the monk, ninja. Still yeah, stabbing him, he's bound. Oh, I'm on the machine, with you, I'm on the machine, with you. Beautiful. Nice. We ain't losing this. I got I'm that. I'm close to you 2LB. Got it. Oh shit. You, you got a plan, you got a plan. You. I was gonna wait for you to use yours. I'm gonna kind of do it on these. Oh, this pile, yeah, hell yeah. Run that dancer's head. Oh, 
Well, we knock out the door. We should back off just in case. <laughs> just a little bit. Because we are very much in the lead. But we don't just want to lose. <laughs> what do you mean? We're Tomberries. We never lose. Oh shit, everyone's just... just yeah, everyone back. Everyone's going to die. Yeah. It's not, it's not worth everyone dying for. A mid's gonna come up surely soon. That or bottom left. What should be like an S rank bottom left next? And if that team. Oh, yep, that's oh, one. Our base, our base, that's it, that's it, that's the game winner. Get ready for reds and yellows. I'm ready. <laughs> in a silence ready. As soon as they rush in, I'll hit us with the bonus healing. Here they come. Uh, yellow machine is that yellow machine? Yeah, good enough. Okay. Finding that paladin. Astro on the left, silence him. Watch out, watch out, reds are here, reds are here, reds are here. Holy hell. Yeah, here come all the yellows now. They just escaped across the long bridge, you yeah. Did you respawn it? Oh shit, you just- oh, right. It was another one of those, so much damage. I mean, at least yellow ain't gonna- Oh shit, yellow backing off. They just full sent it. Well, no, because like, there's, there's one Two on the left there, so yellow is gonna take that. Oh, yeah, yeah, and the, the A rank the bottom left is sort of shit, yeah, yellow ain't gonna give shit. Got the hand, yeah. Signs the monk. Bonus healing. There's a slip jump coming our way. Let's have got that one. And that's someone on the right. Oh, he's in spot. Can I get him? Dude, we've lost like the 100 points. And there's someone on the far right on the ground. Yeah, dude, okay. You're alone, you're alone. Should be good in a minute. I'm on that mid I'm on that mid -zone. And hit him now. Signs in the Astro. Switch into the Astro, yep. Nice. Bonus heals. Scholar. Yep, on him. Finding him now. Yeah, there's a coming up. To the Scholar on the right. Oh shit, no. Oh, oh, They're breaking the Black Mage. Or... I think we go base. Yeah, we get yellow and get base. So there's one. Nice. Monk next to him. On him. Hitting him with silence in 3, 2, now. Bear flare. Razzled him. That'll be in again. Beautiful. Astro on the right, Astro on the right. See him. Yep. Okay. <laughs> Bard. <laughs> Cribblair. Nice left side, left side, left side, Reaper. On him. Hitting him with silence. And the holy. Nice Going for that, go for that 100 bar hard. Bard, 100 bar, yep. Good day, sir. Frazzling the summoner. Step, step, step. Go for the reds near base. 15. Yeah, come with. Oh, we caught all the score back, though. Yeah, we did. Ah, they made the mistake. They all got thirsty for the S. Oh, sir, come back here. Oh, oh, one in our base, one in our base. Just kept this and we win. Just one more. Just one more. <laughs> Just one more, sir. Just a taste. <laughs> Let me cook. <laughs> He's down. <laughs> oh, hello, Scholar. Sorry, don't, don't all just start suddenly die and then we lose the game. <laughs> we got it. <laughs> oh, we won anyway. <laughs> that was a banger. It was. I went 15 2, 43, 1.5 million. 5 0, 43. So we've got 20 kills between us, goddamn. 50k.